China's EV sector is poised to receive a new dynamic participant with the debut of the JM EV01 on April 15th. The once SC01, the sporty two-seater electric coupe, has been designed by car customization veteran Gongjiang Pai and will be produced by Jianglin Group New Energy. Priced at a goal to stay under 300,000 yuan, approximately 41,350 USD, the JM EV01 is positioned as an attainable high-performance electric sports vehicle. The JM EV01 brings stunning performance for an entry-level EV sports car. It is equipped with a twin-motor powertrain boasting a combined output of 320 kilowatt 4 and 35 horsepower, which launches the car from 0 to 100 km per hour in a mere 3.9 seconds. Underpinning this performance is a mid-rear-mounted ternary lithium battery from Cal B with a CLTC-rated range of 520 km. The focus of the engineering team on weight reduction is evident in the tubular space frame chassis and pushrod suspension that enable a minimal 1,365 kg curb weight, remarkably light for an EV. It measures 4,106 mm in length, 1,830 mm in width, and 1,170 mm in height, with a wheelbase of 2,503 mm. The styling, with these dimensions, of an aggressive aerodynamic silhouette, serves to impart classic sports car flair. The production car remains faithful to the concept car, with sweeping LED headlights, a floating roofline effect, courtesy of blacked-out C-pillars, and circular taillights that are a hallmark of its unique styling. True to its purest philosophy, the JMEV-01 holds back from bringing digitalization into the vehicle. Eschewing the large touchscreens found in most electric vehicles available today, it makes do with analog inputs. The cockpit itself is oriented for driving interaction with a rotary gear selector and the unusual manual handbrake, a component seldom found on new electric vehicles. The minimalist dashboard layout favors function with only the essentials such as cruise control and parking sensors. First unveiled in September 2022 as the small sports car SC01, the project was highly sought after, particularly with the backing of Xiaomi. Pre-orders were placed with a token deposit of 199 yuan, approximately 27.5 D, and interests were shown with the initial inquiries from enthusiasts. Later, the SC01 was rebadged and became a subsidiary of Jianling Motors Corporation, JMC, under JMEV. This was of strategic significance because it allowed the car to obtain a sales license through the established car maker. JMEV has also seen a slight change in corporate structure itself. The company had been a Renault JMC joint venture, with the French car maker having invested 1 billion yuan, approximately 145 million USD in 2019, for 50% shareholding. Renault later backed out of the plan in 2023, selling its stake in the venture. Through all this, JMEV has forged ahead with business, now investing its resources into bringing the JME01 to market. The origin of the JMEV01 leads back to Tianjin Gongjiang Pai Auto Technology, which is an auto tuning startup established in 2016. The founder Feng Xiaotong has been a familiar name among car enthusiast groups, particularly his YouTube channel China Car Custom since 2018. Xiaomi Group is also said to have invested tens of millions of yuan in Gongjiang Pai Auto Technology, which further increased the backing of the startup. Also, Xiaomi co-founder Lu Zheng is a director of the company, which indicates that there are tighter corporate relations between Xiaomi and the project. Following the initial 2022 unveiling of the SC01, more specs were announced in 2023, generating hype for the electric coupe. Production was underway by January 2024, per reports then. The project then fell under the radar for some time before it was re-established under the JMEV badge, marking its official addition to Jiangling's production catalog. The development ensured the continuity of the project, providing the project with production certification and facilities required for large-scale production. Beyond its technical specifications, the JMEV01 is a milestone for China's nascent EV sector. The launch of an electric sports car at a relatively affordable price radically enhances consumer choice and shatters conventional wisdom about high-performance electric vehicles. With its championship-winning combination of power, range, and aesthetics, the JMEV01 will find buyers who desire an exhilarating driving experience without the stratospheric costs of premium EV brands.
that it has retained mechanical controls such as the handbrake, suggests the JME V01 is targeting a niche of individuals who are happy to trade the convenience of automation for the closeness of driving. Most EVs court digitalization in the form of touchscreen-laden interiors, but this vehicle's analog approach beats them to it. All these design cues are indicative of a resolve to tap into the essence of the vintage sport cars with the most contemporary electric powertrain technology. Jianlin Group New Energy's participation in the production of the JME V01 is evidence of the company's ambition to develop more electric vehicles. With production certificates in hand and a solid manufacturing base, JME V leverages Jianlin's decades of experience in automobile assembly. The joint venture ensures that the JME V01 is not some trial project but a commercial sports EV with good manufacturing backing. The April 15th market debut is a landmark for the JME V01 as it joins the ranks of the saturated Chinese EV market. The combination of edgy styling, featherweight body, and muscular powertrain will set this electric coupe head and shoulders above the legion of performance-oriented EVs. Its long-term success is uncertain by anything else other than time, but its launch heralds a new age of electric sports vehicles that have been made both performance-oriented and accessible. Since China has now become the world's forefront in its development of electric mobility, the public debut of the JMEV01 showcases the country's greater capacity to produce high-performance EVs as price competitive. Achieving success with the car would pave the way for further innovations in the industry, such as increasingly innovative and affordable electric sports cars. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button to stay updated on all our latest content. We'd love to hear your thoughts, so drop a comment below. And of course, stay tuned for more exciting videos. See you next time.